Clever for a bunch of leeches. <sighs> You'll never get in. It's too well guarded. This is just a start. So much more is coming. So much more. I'll get in. <laughs> No, please! No, no, no! No! I'm on the list. The time is coming! You won't be the only one able to walk in the sun!
pubs closed. <laughs> Sure. Take me to him. Ten minutes early. You know, one of these days, the Roses won't be able to do the talking for you. Sorry, babe. Tonight was a little busy, so I decided to drop in early. Yeah, well... Midnight. Midnight. Is there a reason why you've been keeping me up so late? Still not sleeping? I've been sleeping. It's just what happens when I sleep. Hmm, what? Bad dreams? Oh, babe. It's not just bad dreams. It's a nightmare. The same nightmare. Night after night. What is it? It goes like this. What does it mean? I don't know. It feels like a warning or a prophecy. And who or what is the monster? Nothing I've ever met before. That would imply that something bad got away from you. Nothing bad has ever gotten away from me. Oh, 
Who are you? Attacked by a ghost or a demon. His head was on fire. On fire? The attacked us with this. That's the chain of a ghost rider. I'd recognize it anywhere. A ghost rider? Ever heard of the Headless Horseman? Yes. It's a ghost-like entity on horseback, terrorizing mankind. It's the same principle except yours seems to be on a motorcycle instead of a horse. A car. Will she be okay? She's fine. She's got some bruises, but they'll fade. I've been inviting the two of you over for dinner for weeks. I'm surprised you dropped in like this. I'm sorry, man. Don't be. We'll move her to one of the spare bedrooms, and in the morning I'll make her favorite. Waffles. Waffles. What exactly are these chains? Chains of torment, like Marley in A Christmas Carol. Each link is a sin recounted upon the bearer. Can a ghost rider be killed? That's a stretch, considering they're already dead. Any weaknesses? Revenge won't undo what has been done, Blade. In all my travels, I have not heard of any, and none of my notes or any of my books points to such. However, there is one book that I know of that might have the information. But only the one. What is it? It's called the Darkhold, or the Book of Sins. What is that? It's a compendium of evil, dark spells, that sort of thing. If your Ghost Rider is an entity of evil, it might have the info you need to end it. And where exactly can I find this book? Fortunately for you, I'm not the only supernatural detective working today. There are other resources. Where are these resources? How quickly can you get to New York?
You're going to break into a house. Best make sure it's not the home of a wizard. First question is, why are you breaking into my house? Second question is, who are you? Let me go, and I'll show you exactly who I am. Mm hmm. Vampire. Partial vampire. How do you know that? I have more experience with vampires than most. I think you and I should have a little chat. Take a seat. Allow me to introduce myself. Dr. Stephen Strange. My friends call me Blade. Mr. Blade? No, just Blade. Noted. Blade, forgive my impertinence, but why were you trying to break into the house? I was looking for a book. A friend of mine said it would be here. And did this friend warn you that the library in this particular house is guarded by an innumerable amount of spellcraft? I'll thank you to keep your parlor tricks to yourself. This is not a parlor trick. It's actually a highly developed science. Agent Wu here is consulting with several members of my order on a rather tricky case. Classified. But what he doesn't seem to understand is that the majority of us have spent our lives perfecting True magic, magic with a K, the deep sorcery that keeps the spheres turning in the heavens. Steven. You got it. Did you use the line I gave you? Innumerable spellcraft. Well, I don't want to impose, so mm. I'll be on my way. We still on for next week? Rabbits in a hat. My gods. Wong, we have a visitor. Blade, I'd like you to meet a colleague of mine. Wong, this is Blade. Just Blade? Like Adele? Very good. Now, Blade, can you please tell us what friend sent you here? Hannibal King. Oh, Hannibal! We haven't seen him in ages. Typical practical joker. Is that why he sent a partial vampire to break into the house? He didn't technically send me to break in. I was here to get a book. What book? And why didn't you knock? The Dark Hold. He sent you here to get the Dark Hold. Why? I was attacked. Me and my girlfriend was attacked by a ghost rider. A ghost rider? Do you know which one? There's more than one. There have been several over the years for various reasons. Why would a ghost rider attack a partial vampire? He didn't technically. He technically attacked my girlfriend. He focused the attack on her and not you. Correct. And where is she now? Hannibal King. She's safe with him. And then he sent you to us? Yes. Why wouldn't he call us? Something's off about this. Something isn't quite right. And after what happened last month. What happened last month? Blade, you might actually be the key to helping us understand a rather tricky problem that we've been having. But before I can tell you anything further, I need to make sure that you're trustworthy. I see. It's a simple test, but you have to consent to it. Will you do this? Yes. It's painless, I swear. Please stand up. If you would please roll up your sleeve. Whatever you do, keep breathing. Don't freak out. Holy shit. I said don't freak out. What the hell is that? That is your life thread. This is a rather useful little trick that a tailor friend taught me. It allows me to test your moral fiber. <laughs> yeah, okay, anyway. Uh, it appears as though you've had a rather productive life. Uh, deaths, rebirth, your, your bout with vampirism. 
but it's not your past that interests me. What is it? It's what your past has created. A heart of gold. Shine that bright is rare, especially in these times. So, gentlemen, that means that we have to act. If you'd be so kind as to follow me, and Blade, uh, don't forget your things. Several weeks ago, we had a bizarre attack on the Sanctum. Every magical protection was stretched to its limit. And while we were fighting, something tried to break in through the roof. Who was it? You don't know, but it was very powerful, filled with menace. I suspect that whatever tried to break in here was after the same thing you're after. The Darkhold. The Darkhold. So now what? Now we have to figure out what's going on so we can know how to fight it and how to win. Is that it? Is that the Dark Hole? No, this is the Book of the Vishanti, a magical compendium of all things prognostic and metaphysical. Think of it as a magical Google. Ah. Okay, here we go. Residual magic of persons or entities unknown. This is a fairly simple spell. Yeah, we have all that. Yeah. In fact, in fact, wait. All right. If you would be so kind as to pass me one of those chalices. Thank you very much. Thank you. I need just one drop of your blood. Right here. Olim ab vishanti mando estendes agis. What you are seeing last people that you've seen over the past few days. There's Wong and myself, Cassandra, etc. Do you see this green residue here? That is a trace amount of magic that's been left over as the result of an enchantment. So what does that mean exactly? It means that the theory is correct. The Ghost Rider's not attacking you of its own volition. It's doing so because it was told to do so. Manipulated by another, and it looks like Hannibal's been touched by the same dark magic that the Ghost Rider was. But why me? When you tried to break in, it was because you could see the front door, yes? Yeah. The entire building was exposed. That's an interesting problem. 
Ever since the attack, the house has been imbibed with so many enchantments that only people who are pure of heart can see it. Normally, it just looks like a smoke shop in a tattoo parlor. The enchantment also has the distinction of being able to detect and block out dark magic. Since you are a partial vampire, you are touched by dark magic, but it seems your good heart uh, makes you somewhat undetectable, as if one cancels out the other. If we hadn't been awake, you could have just come in the front door. You could have easily gotten past everything. So whoever wanted that book used me to get past your magic. Correct. So all of this because someone thought I could be a puppet on the string. Cassandra nearly died for that book. Who would do this? There's some powerful magic here, and that Ghost Rider isn't going anywhere soon if he's been tasked with killing Blade. And I'll find him, and I'll kill him. Wait! I think this can be undone. What do you mean? This dark magic. It feels greasy and thick like a stain. It feels like a glamour. Glamour? A spell of concealment, like a mask. A spell made out of lies. And how do we fight it? With truth. Hand me your sword. Orientor, Gladio, Veritatis, et Figuer, Malipati, Salemke, Certis, Esto. Anyone you cut with this sword will be immediately robbed of any enchantment or concealment. And if we are correct that the Ghost Rider is being controlled by another, it will sever the ties binding them. It's powered by your strength of will. So use it wisely. Thanks. And what about the book? Well, if the book is the prize, we can't let him leave up to hand the dark hold is what they want, I suggest we give it to them. It is hidden within the light of a million prayers. You guys seriously don't fuck around when it comes to home security. Well, he does live with a librarian. We do know how to take care of books. <laughs> <clears throat> this is all the evil in the world. Why is it smaller than the other book? Because there is infinitely more good in the universe than bad. And there are plenty of entities that would stop at nothing to get this book. In that case, I think we should take out an extra insurance policy. Strange portaled me here. The dude's a trip. You definitely have to meet him. I'm sure I will one day.
You attacked me, my girl. You blew up my friend's house. Tell me who you're working for. I swear I'll cut into you! I'm not working for anyone. I was being controlled. I never wanted to hurt you. What do you have? Give me one good reason. I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. Sorry doesn't cut it. That's what I try to tell you, listen. I can't be killed. I'm already dead. Then why are you here? Because I was sent to attack you and those you care about. I was sent to blow up the detective's house and the house of the wizard. Strange. Yes. Before I was sent to attack you, I was sent to go steal the book from the wizard. So my employer used some of his minions to attack as well. But it's ultimately your vampire blood that was the key to getting in. If that's true, then why didn't you just wait for the door to open before attacking me? Because I've been trapped in my own head. Just watching from within, unable to do anything while I'm being puppeteered like a toy. By who? It doesn't matter. He already knows. He's coming. Serves me right for sending a pawn to do a king's work. Behind this. Tell me, Daywalker, what is it about mortals that you care so deeply about? And what business of mine is it of yours? So many dead vampires, so many of your own kind, slaughtered by you. And for what? I wouldn't expect you to understand. I know Strange gave you the book. Even now I can feel its presence. Pulsing with dark energy and limitless power. And after I've ripped you to pieces, you'll be spared the glory of the world I will create. The end is now for you, Daywalker. And not even your treasonous hide will save you. You talk too much. Even if I must take it from your corpse. Enough of you! I'll command an entire army of Ghost Riders if I have to. 
And I'll kill more than just your beloved and your friends. I'll unravel your entire existence. In fact, I already have. <laughs> magic in that case I think we should take out an extra insurance policy this will hold him for a few moments so make sure before you give it to him that all of your pieces are lined up understood Why are you smiling? I'm smiling because you're done with disguises. You're done controlling people. You're finished. And you're not very good at this. Cassandra is safe. Strange portal me here. The dude's a trip. You definitely have to meet him. I'm sure I will one day. You've killed nothing. Taken nothing. You've been nothing more than a pain in my ass! You don't belong here. You know, I'm amazed you're so here. Well, to be fair, when you warned me about your life, you did omit a few wizards, demons, and chain ninjas. He's not a ninja. He's... Blade, look at me. I'm not going anywhere. Blade. I can't thank you enough, man. Truly. It was a team effort. I'd like to formally introduce you to someone. Cassandra. This is Ghost Rider. I'm sorry I attacked you. 
You're forgiven. So, where to next? Well, I get a second chance. I got a lot to fix. Wait! What's your name? Robbie. Robbie Reyes. Well, be safe, Robbie Reyes. Before we go, there's something important I need to say to Strange and Wong. Okay. I'll only be a moment. I need you to wait here. Wait. <sighs> there. Now you can give a formal thank you. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for. Rabbit out of the hat. Why didn't you use a real rabbit? Our lease doesn't allow pets. What lease? We don't have, you're the landlord. You charged me to live here! Uh, I'm sorry, but the Sorcerer Supreme is out of the office. What office? He doesn't have an office. He had an office, but he turned it into a private karaoke room for him and Shang-Chi. Uh, sorry to interrupt. Oh, no, please. Please interrupt. We're not done here. Me and Cassandra are going to take some time away. But before we leave, I just wanted to say thank you. All on a day's work. Happy to do it. Time off doesn't seem like a bad idea. A small vacation wouldn't irrevocably derail our work. Oh, we're not going to have any time for that. Nick Fury? Director Fury? Time is of the essence. And I need your help. Or, there won't be time to do anything, ever, again. Damn, that's some good tea.
what do we have here? Sorry, there's been an incident. What has my son done now? 